I'm Trevor and Tracy, uncle and niece from Cheshire. Hi there, welcome back to Family TV Scrabble. Now, before the break, Marianne and Betty, mother and daughter from Manchester, well, they've booked their place already into today's head-to-head -head final. But, of course, they need a family team to play against. And here are two more teams ready and waiting to play onto our giant board. Sheila and Louise, welcome. Sheila, tell us about your nickname. My nickname is Smelly. Mm. The reason being, when I was courting my husband, Every time I got in his car when he picked me up, he said, of course, smelly, but it wasn't through the nasty smell, it was through the <laughs> perfume. <laughs> and it's picked up with all the family now. They all call me smelly. Do they? Well, you know, I can smell it from here. It's lovely, <laughs> Sheila. <laughs> smell fantastic. <laughs> and uh, Louise, welcome. Thank you. Now, tell us about what you do in your spare time. Um, mainly the children take up most of my time. Do they, how many children have you got? Three. Okay, and what are they all, are they all at school at the moment? Yeah, I've got Jamie, he's um, nine, Lauren, six, and Hannah, she's two. So that's quite a handful, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So what do you do to de-stress and unwind? I like to go to bingo at least once a week. Yeah. I enjoy playing bingo and it gives me a bit of sort of sanity and away from the home and the children. And it's, it is a nice evening out and I go with Sheila. Well, good luck you two on TV Scrabble today. Tracy and Trev, welcome to the show. Thank you. Yeah. Tracy... Tell us about driving lessons and you. Right, what it was, my husband took me out for a lesson in reversing and as I was reversing the car, I nearly crashed it into a wall and I had to slam the handbrake on very quickly uh, to stop it from crashing. Have you done your test yet? No. When are you going to do it? Um, I've had to give up the lessons. <laughs> OK, so you're not going to do it for the moment? No. No, you're going to leave it there? No. <laughs> I am, yes. <laughs> Uh, Trevor, nice to see you too. Thank you. Um, most people would use a SWAT to get rid of unwanted flies around the home. Mm -hmm. You've got something else that you do, haven't you? Well, I went to kick one in the bathroom once and uh, I kicked the door for him instead and broke my big toe. So you can safely say, Trev, <laughs> that you broke your toe swatting a fly? I certainly can, yeah. The fly got out free. <laughs> <laughs> did it really? Yeah. But your toe didn't, did it? <laughs> no, it didn't. <laughs> OK, well, better luck on TV Scrabble today, Trev. OK, okay. it's a fly-free studio, so enjoy. <laughs> uh, good luck, everybody at home. Let's play Family TV Scrabble. <laughs> and once again, we'll start with a round of duplicate TV Scrabble, where each of our teams have the same seven letters, only 25 seconds to play the best scoring words they can think of, onto our giant board. So, teams, if you're ready, your first seven coming up, it looks like Trace... And Lou are going to start for your respective teams. Here come your tiles. S, R, O, I, R, S and T. Your time starts now. Time's up. Louise. Stir. Let's play it onto the board. OK, unfortunately, though, we can't accept that. So, no points there. Tracy. Sorts. Let's see it on the board. And that gets you ten points, and there it stays. OK, here come your next seven. Trev's in. Sheila's in on this as well. There are your tiles. N, N, A, U, K, E and B. Your time starts now. Time's up. Smell, uh, Sheila. <laughs> <laughs> Almost got you. What word have you got? Snake. OK, let's play it onto the board. OK, that play gets you 18 points, uh, Trevor. Break. Let's play it onto the board. Gets you 15, so it looks like Sheila's snake is the highest scoring of the two. So it's stored back up on the board. And here come your next set of seven. Lou, you're back in. So you, Tracy, here come your letters. 
N A U I R S and B. Your time starts now. And that's your lot. Tracy. Bead. Let's play it onto the board. Across there. Get you 12 points. Louise. Sir. Yes, madam. Let's play it onto the board. That scores you a total of 19 points. It's the highest scoring of the two. It's going to stay up there on the board. My computer flashing up the word urbanise, which would have got you your bonus 50 and another 20, a total play of 70 points. But now, here come your final set of seven letters in this round. Sheila and Trev, you're back in play. Here come your tiles. H, D, I, O, V, Y and A. Your time starts now. Time's up. Sheila, not playing a word. No, sorry. No, missing out this time, no problem. Trev. Tie. Let's play it onto the board. No, sadly, because YA isn't allowed, so we can't accept tie. Not to worry. That's the end of our duplicate round of TV Scrabble. And the scores at the moment are Louise and Sheila, you have 37. Trev and Tracy, you also have 37 points. Another close game here, and we move on to round two, our speed round, where both our family teams have 60 seconds to score as many points as they possibly can. So, I'll tell you what, we'll go with Louise first of all. If you're ready, you're going to be pressing. Sheila, you're going to be in support there. You can confer in this round. And if you're ready, here come your seven tiles. O, T, A, I, S, R and L. Your time starts now. Louise and Sheila, that's your minute up. You've scored another 64 points. It's good play. So, Trevor and Tracy, here come your set of seven. E, E, A, Q, N, F and S. Your time starts now. Your time is up.
But which of our teams is going through to today's head-to-head -to -head final? You went into this round neck and neck, and it's come out close as well. Louise and Sheila, you finish with 101 points. Trev and Trace, you finish with 109, so you're going through. <laughs> hey, it's closer now, I must say. Uh, but Louise and Sheila, only eight points behind. That was phew, close. OK, well, we'll send you home with your own TV Scrabble trophies and your goodies. So, well done, Louise and Sheila. Trevor and Tracy, you're through to today's head-to-head -head final, where you'll be playing for a place in our semi-finals. All you've got to decide is which of you is going to be playing. Mm, Who's it going to be? Oh, I see. Very quickly, <laughs> it's going to be Trace. I think you've been forced into that one, Tracy. So, you oh, yes. ready to come back in a few minutes' time? Yes. Go and chill out for now. But uh, Trevor and Tracy, well done. <laughs> and we welcome back our winner from part one. Betty, welcome back. Thank you. So you've left your daughter Marianne in the audience to watch you. Yes, I have. She was chicken. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, good luck to you. Uh, good luck yeah. to you, Tracy, as well. Yeah. It's a head-to-head -head final, and there's a place in the semi-finals at stake here, as both our contestants do battle non-stop for two minutes, with play switching from player to player every 30 seconds when they hear this sound. So, Tracy, you bring with you more points into the head-to-head -head final. And being Family TV Scrabble, however, it means you're going first, but the scores get wiped to zero. Right. So, if you're both ready, best of luck. Okay. Here come your first seven tiles. S, E, T, Y, E, A and D. Your time starts now. OK, ladies, that's your time up. <coughs> Both played well, but we need to look at the scores at the end of that to find out which of you is going into the Family TV Scrabble semi-finals. So, first of all, Betty, you finish with... 28 points. Mm -hmm. Tracy, you finish with... 64 points. So you're going through. Well played, Betty. Have you enjoyed yeah. it? Yes, I have. Best wishes to your daughter, Marianne, of course, who played with you earlier. You take back with you your TV Scrabble trophy and goodies. Well done, Betty. Thank you very much. And Tracy, many congratulations. You've now got a place in the semi finals. Of course, with your uncle Trev. Let's welcome him back because he's played with you earlier as well. There we are. OK. Thank you. And a sporting handshake to mm -hmm. Betty there and a cuddle for your niece there. Fantastic. <laughs> we'll see you soon in the semi finals. Trevor and Tracy, well done. So that's it once again for today. There'll be more TV Scrabble on a TV near you very soon. And get ready to play on at home for another big prize. Goodbye for now.
If you would like to be a contestant on TV Scrabble, call 0901 270 6001. Next to play Family TV Scrabble, Philip and Suzanne Absalom, husband and wife from Oxford, and Trevor and Tracy, uncle and niece from Cheshire. Hello and a warm welcome back to our Family TV Scrabble semi-final. And in case you missed it, before the break, Toby and Jenny, husband and wife from Hampshire, booked their place in today's head-to-head -head final. But who will they be meeting? Will it be Suzanne? And Philip, we shall see. Welcome back to the show. Hello. So, Suzanne, what have you done to relax? Well, I haven't been able to go out because I was recognised in the supermarket and now I'm like a superstar. You're so... well, from when you were last yeah, on TV so Spell? Yeah, I have to stay indoors with my sunglasses behind the curtains. <laughs> so many people watch this show now. Yeah, yeah, they recognised me. It's getting out of hand. Well, it was only one. <laughs> <laughs> One's better than none. Well, that's it, exactly. How about you, Phil? Um... Back to the daily routine, really, back at work. Yeah. Um, but I've been doing a little bit of DIY decorating the bedroom. <laughs> well, good luck today, anyway, in the semi final. Okay, thank you very Hope much. Hope you enjoy it. Tracy and Trevor, welcome back. Thank you. Now, thank Tracy, how about you? I know you play a lot of board games and TV Scrabble. What have you done to unwind? Uh, I've been watching TV Scrabble and playing with the kids mainly. Yeah. So, more of the same? Yes. How are you feeling about today? Uh, pretty confident. Are you? Don't feel any more tense than the last time? No, no. Hi, Trev. Hi. How's about you? I've been 